Hello everyone, Trekworks here again. Just wanted to come back and give you an update on our Reliant buildup. I've spent a lot of time this weekend. I've got my uh, wiring uh, started inside the hull there doing my navigation system and uh, some more of the internal lighting and I've done some of the uh, detail work up on the top side here. You can see I've got some of my phaser banks painted on and uh, the bridge detail and some of the other little things that I'm doing. The crystal here at the back and um, the shuttle bays. I still haven't glued the top of the saucer down yet so there's going to be a couple little light gaps there i got to fix. And I've gone in and done some work here on the bottom and um, things are looking pretty good. I've uh, had quite a lot of fun with this. I've um, really really enjoyed working with the paragraphics kit on this. This is really making that thing uh, spruce it up really nice and just add so much detail to it. I'll go ahead and uh, turn the lighting system on here for you so you can see what uh, things are starting to come around pretty good. There's the uh, officer's lounge there and here at the back you can see uh, just how really nice that detail looks on those um, shuttle bays there. That really really looks just like the Reliant's supposed to. I did these little grills here on the sides here too that are lit up just a little bit and uh, you can see I got my on the bottom side here I've got my uh, strobes going on there. Those are just the navigation flashers. There's some separate ones that you wire up for the individual white uh, flashing strobes that go in various spots. I did a lot of work on the uh, sensor array here down on the bottom and I've got my little I hope you can see that I'm not blurring it too much but I've got my little red effect going on there at the front. I'll be doing the same thing at the top of the uh, uh, bridge. But uh, yep, it's looking pretty good. I'm really happy with it so far. Let me turn out the light here and you can see uh, some of the details come through here. I may tone those corner pieces down just a little bit more. They're still just a little bit too bright for my liking. I think I'll put something behind those and tone those down just a little bit more. But um, You can see that uh, the light effect is working really good on it. It's, all the lights are showing through really nice and even. I haven't done my lighting here at the front of the saucer yet either. I've got to go back and do that. I'm still working out just exactly how I'm going to do that. But so far, so good. I'm really, really happy with everything so far. Um, and things are shaping up pretty nicely. So I just thought I'd come back and give you this update. And uh, I'll be back in a few more days once I get my... Uh, I'm going to start assembling the warp engines. I still haven't gotten the... Uh, um, Flux chiller grills in from Don's Light and Magic. I think they're back ordered, so I might be waiting for a little bit, but I'll go ahead and get the engines all assembled and do all that stuff on it while I'm waiting. So, anyway, uh, just another update on the Reliant, and things are coming along nice. So, we'll see you on the next video, everybody. And until then, happy modeling.